We're mixing things up a bit today with this one. All right, we're headed into the historic railroad tunnels. A little bit bigger than a mine at it. This is incredibly spacious. Look how high up that ceiling is. I see it. It's like almost like a big mine. A very, very big mine. Yeah. I mean, it's essentially the same construction techniques. Yeah. Blast through, lay down track. It's something to see those steam trains chugging through here. Yeah, it would have been fascinating. Oh, look. There's something up above us. Oh, wow. What is that? Uh, I'd say that's an air shaft, probably. Just like in wow. the mine. Yeah. You see, it's a capped air shaft, just like in a mine. Okay. And that sort of addresses the ventilation issues we were just talking about with the smoke and the steam and everything. I like what you're saying. A solid rock though, the whole way. Oh, that's crazy. Sealed off now. Yeah, they, they sealed off so stuff wouldn't fall down it. Okay, so we may be inside a railroad tunnel, but that's timbering. That's classic timbering, like we see in the mines all the time, to uh, support the top of this tunnel here. That's really cool to see that. All right, headed for the exit of the first tunnel now. Oh, these are you know, steel beams going all the way across. That's actually timbered. Graffiti, huh? Yeah. That was a long one we just went through. You can see there's a short one coming up here. Okay. Yeah. Much shorter. These are snow sheds. Where? What we're walking in right now. They are to uh, protect the trains, you know, of course, from the heavy snow. Yeah. Blocking the rails, but also avalanches and things like that. That's a cool one. Yeah, she looks kind of cool. Yeah, higher standard in here. Yeah. I guess because the, uh, the lazy guys just hit the first one. And if you do something like this, you gotta put some work in. Sure. That really opens up up there. Look at these. That's really cool. There's a platform right there. See that platform? Yeah. And then, oh look, you can you can walk up. Like there used, look right there. There used to be steps right there or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah, something. You walk up to there, and then go over, and work your way up. Yeah. There. And that's how high do you think that is? Like that's like 40, 50 feet up. It's pretty high. Huh. You can store more, you, you can store a ship if you want to do it. Yeah, you could. You know, pack it and just leave Yeah, you really could. So here's the old bridge, the old arch bridge for uh, oh, okay. Highway 40. Well, we should be getting better and better views of Donner Lake as we proceed. Oh, yeah? yeah. We're gonna go right alongside it. This looks like a long one. I don't even see the daylight yeah. into this one. You can see pretty clearly, you know, like the, obviously we're in the more modern workings now, or, uh, you know, modern town. Then here's the older, you know, where they get into the, yeah. the blasted out rock. Oh, that's a one better. So do I. It's kind of cool looking to see those people silhouetted in the yeah, light. Exactly. 
almost like raptured by the light. Yeah, exactly. Like aliens. It's interesting, you can, if you look at the ceiling, you can see the stain left by the smoke and oh, soot and such yeah. as it, uh, you know, as day all the, after day after day. Yeah, as the old steam trains came yeah. through. Brilliant. I like you could actually climb up out here. Yeah, if we want to get out. Ah, oh, looks like it was a, some kind of access door. Yeah. See all the burned... Like an emergency exit, yeah. maybe? See all the burned railroad ties here? Yeah. Are we going to check the view over there? Yeah. Actually, let's go to the right. A lot of pieces of metal, huh? Yeah, it's all stuff they hauled out. Oh, look at that one. That was crusty. That's a cool one. Well made. Yeah. Wow, look at that, Justin. Nice looking view. Now look how the snow, the snow shed keeps going. Yeah. Wraps its way all around. Oh, yeah. Until the bend. I'm glad those guys are there to get some scale. You know what I mean? Because otherwise, yeah. it's hard to understand. It's how, it's how big it is. Yeah. How high. That, the eye right there is really, really well done. Yeah. Hmm. It's supposed to be like what? A bird? Really? I don't know. I really don't know. Oh, that snake's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Poor Lisa. Even if he's a friend of mine, I'm this guy. I don't know if he's a friend of mine, no, it's one of those guys, a bully. It's one of these bullies. Yeah. Those I think you're right. But the Lisa is lost somewhere. Oh, look at this one. That's yeah, pretty good stuff. <laughs> pretty good stuff in here. Back into the darkness. In darkness. That is a cool one. Yeah. And there's the exit finally way off in the distance. Looks cool. Yeah, it's like the light reflecting yeah. on the sides. The stripes. Yeah. Yeah, look at this rock wall right here. That's impressive. All right, almost at the exit, and we're both really impressed by the size of this wall. Yeah, look at these, wow. I mean, I can't imagine getting some of those boulders up there. Look about doing this, like, all by hand. Those are massive. Wow. Go stand next to that way, so you'll get a sense of how large. Yeah, thank you. So you can see how large all these are in relation to Eleonora. All right, a little bit of a gap and then we're right back in the snow sheds. That tells you how severe the winters get here. Yeah, yeah, the sheet comes down. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, with a fang coming out of it or the claw or whatever. It's good stuff.
All right, it gets really dark up ahead. All right, Eleanor, are you ready to plunge into the darkness? Yeah, into the blackness. Yeah, that is a large washout. And that is recent too. That's from this winter. Is it? Yeah, that tree out there is just recently down. That's pretty significant. Crazy. All of damage. Yeah, for sure. You see the snow shed over there in the distance. Mm -mm. All right. Well, we'll cross down there. Here's a look back at some of the tunnels and snow sheds we've passed through. The tunnel we just exited is coming into view now, and you can see that big washout we were talking about there. So here's the tunnel we just came out of, and uh, here's another view of that pretty dramatic washout. You see it plunges down the ravine there and into the valley below. And we're headed to this tunnel up here. This is a dark one. Yeah. We don't see anything. Not in this one. We're going straight into the blackness of this one. It's like we're going to something the mine. The construction in here is different than the other tunnels. You notice that? The construction in here is different than the other tunnels. It's like it's got ribs. Yes, it does seem very solid. Ah, they had roll-up doors here, I see. For what reason? Well, yeah, just for access and things like that. I bet there's a good view of the lake here. All right, there is a good view of Donner Lake right there. And all the homes that are ruining it. All right, back in through the roll-up door, continuing through the tunnels. That's the way we came from. And the Italian is leading the way this way. I think these boulders are the biggest we've seen in any of the sections. Really impressive. But, ah, all right. We've got a really dangerous section there. Uh, as you can see, a monster lives there. All right, something interesting here. We didn't see any other sections. And you can see all the signal cables are still intact running through here. So that's interesting. Like I said, we haven't seen that in any other sections of these tunnels, but we're farther away from where many people get to now. So that obviously makes a difference. One of those huge boulders. I mean, it's really dark back here. See those eyes right there that reflect? That's creepy cool. This is the, uh, it's interesting. It's the first time we've seen a collapse inside here. You know? Yeah. All right, like I said, I think it's open for a while now. Okay, okay there's the snow shed we just came out of. And the rail bed continues on like this. You can see there's a nice rock wall there. Uh, we're pretty much out of the snow sheds for a while because the train tracks wrap around this sort of side canyon here. You can see 
them again over there and they wrap around this whole hill without any snow sheds that I know of, or at least very minimal. So I think we'll wrap the video up here. This nice view of uh, Donner Lake and the mountain next to it. Say goodbye, Eleanor. Arrivederci.